Hello ACU family, this is uh, Ray Fernandez um, coming to you from the Poconos. Uh, Pastor Ramon um, brought us excellent points uh, in regards to the book of Joel. Um, what, I, um, what I like most about the book of Joel is described in Acts chapter 2 about the spirit being poured uh, upon all flesh. Uh, another thing I enjoyed that uh, uh, Pastor Ramon uh, mentioned was, uh, and I'm just reading my notes here, <laughs> um, especially verse um, chapter 2, where it says, uh, where the prophet is telling uh, Judah to return with all their hearts. Um, that is so true. Sometimes we do return to the Lord, but uh, we leave our hearts behind. Um, yes, it's good to come to church, um, give offerings, sing worship music, read the Bible, but it has our heart been returned to the Lord. And, um, and that's sometimes we could, uh, he also mentioned something about surviving judgment. Um, I believe when the Lord is, uh, <laughs> judging us, uh, another point he said is about judging his children. Um, how can God judge the world and his children be in disarray? But uh, how do we survive judgment? Or how do we survive? I know the word judgment sounds extreme. But how do we uh, survive chastising or discipline from the Lord? Um, and it's by returning to Him uh, with all our hearts. Um, and uh, and that's a, a point. He brought up several, several points. Um, and again, uh, verse 32, which says, of chapter 2, it says, uh, Everyone who calls on the name of the Lord will be saved. So what I like, what I love about the theme of the uh, prophets, yes, the Lord brings judgment, uh, right, righteous judgment, but he also brings uh, a redemption uh, towards the end. Uh, and that's uh, fascinating. I, I think that's also um, the way God works um, throughout the Bible. Yes, he is a judge, but he's also a redeemer. And uh, those are uh, a few key points that I uh, got from uh, Pastor uh, Ramon in regards to Joel. And uh, again, it's about again judging, but also restoration. And I, I think that's about uh, that's basically the key of the Christian life. <laughs> the Lord uh, obviously disciplines us because He loves us. One Father will not discipline the children He loves. But then, even in that discipline, there's a time of restoration and a time of Him uh, just. Uh, uh, planting our, our feet on solid rock. Okay, okay, see you family. Have a wonderful day.